Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Maximus Black. And Nova War. And we're bringing you a normal ass, normal game sent in by the fans on D2DGamer.com. Mr. Maximus Black. Yes, sir. Do you ever go in your mind sometimes and think about back in junior high, the teachers that you loved and the teachers that you hate? Mm hmm. If you had to say who is your favorite teacher in junior high, who would that have been? Mr. Mataru. It's <laughs> a good teacher. I don't even remember that teacher's name. Uh, you didn't go to Canard. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah, you were there for what? One, one year. year. Grade seven. Right. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mr. Mataru. He was yes. really cool. He was this Indian, um, an Indian teacher, uh, and he was... He had this way about him when he was talking. He was like, "Yeah, you did good. Just settle down, everybody. You settle down right now. You don't. You do not move from that table." And and we would mock him all the time. Be like, "No, you settle down." And he'd be like, "No, you don't talk like me." I said, "Yeah, I do. I talk like you." Well, and, you and must have sounded. You sounds like you were. You sounded strikingly similar. <laughs> <laughs> That's a. That's that must have been terrifying for yeah. him. Yeah, yeah. He used to put me in timeout and make me yes. Uh, the, in junior high, and he was your favorite. Yeah, yeah, no, but he was just fun. He was just funny teacher. Okay. Because uh, he could, you know, he could take it and dish it out. You know what I mean? Like some teachers are like, yeah, nah. You know, they can't take a joke. But and, he they, could. and they really make that sound too. Teachers when they get angry. Yeah. Nah, nah. Nah, nah. But uh, his thing was, I don't know if it was like that in other schools. No, no, no. At our school, they used to give you a referral. They used to send you down to like the room. Yep. Same. Same with. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah no, yeah. but but at Kennard, right. They used to uh, just send you out in the hall, and you had to stand in the hall. Oh. Yeah, like he would wow, just stand that's in the a hall. Punishment. Yeah, yeah. And like we would literally do that just so we could stand in the hall, and then I'd like run down to the gym and look at all the the girls and that are running around and playing volleyball. Whose terrible decision was it to only let you stand in the hall? I don't know. The principal did it. At the time, he was black too. So top right position, we are looking at Mike. Yep, down, down here in here. the position, we're looking at Mr. Cordell. Why did I even say he was black? Did that? Did I even have a purpose? You're racist. Yeah. You just didn't even know it. Yeah. Now you do. Mm -hmm. Congratulations. Welcome to the club. You don't know them right. We, we legally couldn't call ourselves KKK, so we, we are the the KKC. Still, if you pronounce it, it's, it still sounds relatively the same. So wrong. It's just a hard C. A really hard C. Just KK. So, let's get into this game, <laughs> shall we? This is, just, this is just messed up. Oh, so, side tracking. It looks like we have a, uh, a four racks for a Mr. Cordell. And uh, that sounds like some sort of like a Mexican. Teacher? No, like Mexican <laughs> uh like cartel, like some sort of. It just reminds me of bad people, bad guys. This is Mr. Cordell, yeah, heads up a cartel. Yeah, just those. So a bunch of Marines being pumped out for <laughs> Mr. Uh, Cardell, and up top here just a normal ass opening. Uh, just getting your expansion, got out some lings. Probably gonna drop down a spine crawler. Yep, there it is. And uh, Queen being built. He's going to actually run the Queen down this way. I wonder if he's going to drop maybe a Tumor down first. And uh, just going to run down these uh, these links, see what kind of information he can get. And yep. that information is not going to be good. So that's a lot of uh, a lot of Marines. And really, he might see he might see two at most. I don't even think he'll see the second one there. It's awful far away. Uh, he might at the very least just see the one up front and then see some Marines. Uh, it's just depending on whether or not all the Marines come down to shoot these links. Yeah. Uh, and these are really... Uh, great, you know, it's just information zerglings, they're not here to do a lot of damage, they're only here to do damage if the opening is there, and it's likely not going to be there. Uh, he's going to go up here and Ooh, see he it. Sees it all. Oh, he sees that second Rax, and he sees a lot of Marines. Yeah, so he knows that an all-in is, is basically <clears throat> coming, um, or, or at, at least a... Virtually, it's it's an all-in. I mean, when you're when you're just getting Marines like it's, this, he knows a uh, he knows that strong aggression is on and the way. Look at that a second immediately queen and a bane down a nest. nest, and that's uh, exactly yep. what he needs to do. And oh there's... wow, he is really going for it. Yep. And he's got that OP mule down. He is going to still mine some minerals on the. Uh, Question is, is this attack. going to finish in time? And is he going to be able to build enough banelings to actually uh, fend this off? It's going to be extremely know. close because there's this... a lot. 
this is this is scary. That is a lot of units. Even just having the SCVs there, just to just to serve their purposes, a meat shield can yeah. be more than enough uh, to to secure a game with only even maybe six Marines at most. Uh, and they, he does have some Zerglings down there. He's put off to the side. It looks like he might be waiting for an opportunity to roll some Banelings into the Terran base. Although Ooh, it is fairly risky, secure. That's a risky spot to start making those Banelings. Uh, I know. I'm not sure I, I agree with it quite yet. And he is actually going to go straight for this expansion. Two Queens up front are going to take the front of this damage. And they're oh, going to wow. go down very quickly. Oh, wow. Melted. Oh. There are so many Marines. But those, but once again, Adam, those are the Meat Shields. They just soaked up a Absolutely. lot of the damage. And now, and now uh, Mike is actually supply blocked. Wow. So now he's in serious. So he was in trouble before. Yeah, no, oh, they, the, all those oh, links just got melted. Oh, and they are completely melted. And now Mike is in a terrible position. He, he actually had here. that macro hatch just finishing now. And it looks like the Marines are going to get rid of it really quickly. That's going to go down. He's going to want to cancel that. He's going to want to cancel it. Oh, he, does not cancel. he didn't cancel. He needs to get rid of this Banelings nest right now. He needs to just destroy that, destroy the spawning pool. And that's basically it. He does have an OP mule, or he did. Now he's just not even using his energy yep. uh, to collect some minerals and keep making. But and it looks like he tried to get up oh, there. Oh, look at that. He actually no closed dice. that off just in the uh, nick of time. And all he has left is... Uh, oh, we have some Banelings oh, being put wow. together here. And a couple more Banelings to come out. He does actually have enough to... Uh, to uh, basically, well, no, he only has enough just really to work with these Banelings now. He's only going to have them and these uh, remaining Zerglings and a couple of drones, which are going to get brave and try and get some... Nope. But they're <laughs> going to get brave and go back and no, get no. some minerals. No. No, they decided not to. They're going to go back to the uh, the natural here. And I don't know... Is he, gonna, this is going to be close. It, it all depends. If uh, if, if uh, these Mr. Cornell is going to... Uh, oh, no! Oh, wow. What a, oh, no! What a great surround here. And these Marines are just walking... Oh no! Oh! Oh, there's still two main things left. No, oh, they're gonna sink. Oh, they're so down. close. Oh wow, that's game. Oh no! Oh wow! Oh wow! That was a. Are you serious? That was brutal. Uh, Mr. Mr. Cordell oh. just did a horrible job at grouping up all of his Marines. Some of the worst oh, stutter wow. step I've ever seen in my life. Oh, Mr. Cordell, you're hating it right now. And look at this. All these drones are really not doing anything. We take a look at the units tab. Thirteen drones on production. To absolutely and nothing. These, and these links picking off everything else. It's game. There is virtually nothing in the base for Mr. Cordell. Not even a mule. He can't even oh he just got a mule and he's got one marine now yeah, but these links are gonna be able to pick off oh yeah mules. i'm uh, there is no happy ending here for mr cordell he is going to get completely and utterly destroyed there is no hope the zerglings are there gg cordell throws up the gg well a little bit of well played in there and down he goes you know what that's that's his own fault he didn't when he went into the base he, he didn't kill the, the game nest. he didn't kill it he just he went after the hatchery it's like dude just kill the main structures that make create units that allow you to create units and then worry about everything else. I mean, and, he's not going to be able to do much with drones. And he lowered his defenses back at base. Oh, yeah, Those Zerglings yeah. actually walked right in because yeah. he had brought them down for some reinforcements. He might have gotten rid of one of those. Uh, yeah. Yeah, those, absolutely. And you know what, Adam? If he would have left a couple of uh, Marines here. It's all he needed. And he would have been able to keep up with those OP mules with the 13 drones. Definitely. And he already had all of these structures to create more and more waves of units. Uh, Mike ha was forced to remake a spawning pool. He was, at that point, it was relatively even. But if Mr. Cordell wanted to really push in again, he definitely could have done it one more time. But unfortunately, uh, he he just slipped up big time. Yeah, no, just uh, just not a lot of great decisions towards the end there. And Mike will take the game with a couple of banelings and uh, a, a ragtag group of zerglings. Ladies and gentlemen, mm. this has been another regular game sent in to the... To, uh, sent, uh, sent in, uh, yeah, I did that last uh, time. Canuckville, Canada. I've got... I, I actually can't follow that up. <laughs>